Hi guys, it's I'm Stark and today we are looking at slumping and mass movement. So when there are loads of rain, it soaks into the impermeable ground on a cliff, say. Then it makes its way down to the clay on the cliff, which is impermeable. Um, the clay then becomes extremely heavy. Um, to help this, uh, to, well it's not a good thing, but to help it slump, the, um, the waves also attack the cliff. Then the cliff becomes really heavy and it slumps under its own weight. This fallen material is then washed away and the cliff retreats. Now, this is a problem because if you have a house, for example, on the coast, it, is, it can possibly fall off the cliff because of the fact that the cliff underneath it has fallen away into the river because of slumping. So another thing we have to look at is mass movement. And the definition of mass movement is rock falls, mudslides and landslides are all types of mass movement. And they occur as a combination of waves weakening the cliff and subaerial processes further up the cliff. So these are all where a, um, lots of rocks and everything is washed away from the cliff and it, is all, it ends up retreating normally. And these are all problems tr um, commonly found in the UK because of the fact that lots of houses are getting washed away and people are having to move their house because of all this erosion, the weathering, and these are all problems that have to be sorted out. So thank you for watching, I know it's a short video, but uh, please can you subscribe to my channel and visit my website, the link's below. Thank you and goodbye.